Hello, I'm going to show you how you can retarget your Unreal 5 mannequin animations over to a metahuman. I'm using Unreal 5.2. Uh, looking online, the searches I've done, there will seem to be many different ways of doing it and really complicated. I've only just upgraded to 5.2 and I believe it's a lot more streamlined now. If you know of any other ways it's even quicker, please put a comment below. Okay, in this scene, this is a brand new scene, and all I've got in here is the motion mocap central core motion pack, and then I've got one metahuman. Regarding how to bring a metahuman in, search online, you'll find a, a tutorial that'll help you um, do that. Okay, uh, the Unreal 5 mannequin is from Mesh's folder SKM. The mocap central packs all come with the characters and the mannequins. And the mannequins actually available as a pack you can download uh, from the Unreal Store Marketplace. Great, so if I select the Unreal 5, I go click on the animation and I can go to asset and let's put an animation on so we can see it working. Let me actually find the one I like to start with just because it's really important how the, it's a really good telltale scene of how the arms uh, are placed. Um, this is the idle, if I hit play, not a ton of animation going on there, but you can kind of see where it's, um, where, you know, his proportions are sitting. So if we hit the metahuman and I go to his body and I go to assets, you can see there's none of those animations are here because there's no um, animations for this metahuman rig. First thing that's really important to do is to metahumans open up um, your blueprint for the metahuman and you need to know what proportion skeleton it's using and you can click on body and you can see it's M med uh, narrow body all the different proportions uh, are varied across um, all the metahuman types so it's important that you know that so you retarget to the correct one okay I'm going to do a quick save all where I am great so let's start the retargeting process you're going to go into mannequin or characters mannequin rigs and you'll see this retarget retarget a uh, mannequin here. I'm going to double click and open this up. First thing you'll notice is it looks like there's just one mannequin in here. There is two and you needed an offset. Let's put that in now. Right, so now we can see two of them. Next thing I can do is I need to change this to the IK MediHuman. At this point I've actually had this crash a few times. So I'm just going to save where I am and let's see what happens. So let's change this target to MetaHuman. So we did experience a, a crash there. I've just reopened Unreal. It actually doesn't take long. It was pretty quick. So let's go back into the same location. Let's open up the RTG. Luckily, I'd saved, and you can see the offset. Now let's try it, and you can see this IK MetaHuman. Select that. And the other thing I want to do is we got the female version. I want to find the male version, so I'm going to scroll down and it was this one here it's a little unexciting because there's not a much geo um, to see but you get the idea so the next step here is to really make sure the animation lines up is to go over to chain mapping and where there's IK goal we're going to turn off blend to source turn that down and you can actually see the arms as I do this adjust a little bit Let's do it for the feet. I think there's very there's a slight movement there. Anyway, I want to do that, and I'm going to hit save at this point. Great. Let's now find the same animation, and it was stand idle here. So if we double click, we can see um, the animations come across. Let's export this and see how it looks. So to do that, we can select the animation. Uh, export selected animations. You can also shift select at this point as well. Um, actually, let's do a couple of them. Let's maybe do this point one as well. I'm doing a control uh, and click there. So there two animations. Export. I've already got a folder here, anims. You can add a, a suffix if you really want to separate it, but um, which can be good, but I'll just go ahead and not do that. Let me hit save. Let me close. Uh, here's our animations here. All right. Let's click on our MetaHuman asset, animation asset. We can see standing, and let's hit play. 
so you can see that is a really good retarget on our metahuman there and the hands aren't clipping they're at the right place here so let's stop that let's try the other animation that we had we had exported which was the point uh, and let's see and let's hit play see it's doing a finger point there so that seems to be working really well okay great uh, that's it if you have any comments feel free to add them below if there's a, a quicker way or I'm missing something I'm definitely learning right now uh, this has been the fastest process I've seen right now to be able to do the retargeting but it does work okay thanks a lot